Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse. First reactions. This movie opens up next week, guys. Uh, Across the Spider-Verse 2. Uh, reactions say it surpasses the first. So Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse is garnering wide uh, spread acclaim. So we got some initial reactions out here. Let's take a look at some of these initial reactions for Across the Spider-Verse. It defies its high expectations to spin a visually stunning next chapter that swings and soars. That's a comforting, resonating coming-of-age story that pales well, or sorry, that pairs well with the eye-popping animation, music, darkness, and meta humor. Absolutely phenomenal. Now, guys, I'm on the short end, like I'm on the very absolute minority where I don't like that kind of style of animation. Um, I hope it's smooth like Puss in Boots was. If it was smooth like Puss in Boots, then I can handle it. The, the missing frame bit, where it's like choppy, uh, like the new TMNT stuff, I, I can't, I can't, my eyes just don't, my, I hate it. I don't like it. Uh, it doesn't compute up here for me. Uh, but that's the new style. Um, we saw that very much in the first one, right? Uh, that's just, I'm in the minority. Don't pay attention to me for, when it comes to this criticism about the animation. It's the story, James. You always talk about the story. Yes, it's the story comes first. So, uh, Spider-Man and the Spider-Verse raised the bar with its unique animation style and the way of storytelling. Minds were blown when it was released and fans thought that there was no way it could be topped. Think again. Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse raises its own bar, which seemed impossible. So, people are digging it, man. Okay, uh, Across the Spider-Verse lives one step of above masterpiece well that's quite the boast that is a masterpiece it's an actual work of art every frame deserves to be hung in a museum the jokes and nods to spidey lore are perfect it's outstanding so i'll be taking my uh niece to see this next week but i suppose uh it's gonna it's not gonna be priority for me next week guys uh because the boogeyman also opens up against it and of course you know that i am a genre fan i am a horror fan First and foremost, so I'll be seeing the Boogeyman on Thursday, uh, not Spider-Man uh, across the Spider-Verse. But oh, James, how could you be? How could you profess to be a, a, a Spider-Man fan? Well, guys, that doesn't mean that I'm not going to go see it. I'm going to go see it probably on Saturday, not this Saturday, but next one. Uh, it's debuted with a 97% on Rotten Tomatoes. Has it? Okay. Uh. Well. Maybe we should just pull up the Rotten Tomatoes, James, and see if uh, it's up there. Uh, that would have been a good thing to pull first, um, as you are talking about early buzz for Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse. And um, let's see if it's hidden in here somewhere. And I do not see it. So we will say Across the Spider. And pull it up. Yeah, it's not up there. What the heck are you guys talking about? I'm not seeing a score here. Because I'm pretty sure the embargo is still up. Maybe that's the older one that they were talking about, the first one. Yeah. Uh, I'm not seeing a rating for it. But people are hyped. People are excited for this. Uh, the people, this is the kind of movie that's going to be immune to criticism. Somebody can come out and say, well, the story didn't work like this. And it had some pacing issues. And the people just won't care. Uh, they don't, it's one of those movies, right? Uh, we just had one of those with like Fast 10 where hey, if you, they don't care about the, the acting quality or anything like that. This is going to be one of those ones where it's kind of like, I love this movie even before I've seen it kind of thing. There you go. It's, if that's your bag, then have at it. But, you know, I prefer to go into things with an open mind and giving things a fair shake. Anyway, uh, Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse is not surprising, not surprisingly terrific. It's a bigger story spread out over the movie and next, but it's still about Miles wanting to be accepted for who he is. I laughed out loud like eight times. So the comedy's there. Good. Um, that's what you want to hear for the follow-up for Spider-Man. Spider-Man into the Spider-Verse, or this one's called Across the Spider-Verse. This one's going to be like part one of this next chapter, right? Because next year, part two comes out. Because this was originally in two parts, right? Across the Spider-Verse, first reactions are out, and they're, uh, well, reasonably good. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below, and we will talk about it. Next up, let's talk about early buzz for the Transformers Rise of the Beasts. Yeah, that movie comes out a week after the Spider-Man movie. So Transformers.